Absolute chicken. <laughs> Put some extra blessings on this place. <laughs> I appreciate that. Welcome to the black market. Man. Thank you. All Thank the people you. watching today, look here. I be going, I be searching high, I be searching low, and then I make a left and I ask people, and then I be in the streets, and then I get on social media and I be tuned in with what black people got going on as far as businesses, uh, industries, uh, whatever's on the cusp of about to happen with black people, I be on there. That's why this is the black market, so we can have people on here Come on here and show their products and, and tell about their business, man. That's what this whole thing is about. So today, we got Italian Twine. That's the watch company right here, owned by none other than Mr. Eric Haywood. How you doing, brother? Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Thanks for having me. Greatly appreciate it. No, no problem. It, it's your fault. You should have been here. <laughs> you should have been here. And looking at what you got over here, yeah, you should have been tapped in with the black market, man. How did all this come about? So my business partner actually started the company Word. ten years ago. My what college that? roommate. What at? Portsmouth, Virginia, that's where our headquarters is. Okay, baby. So that's where he is. He's in our headquarters actually putting together watches, doing the, the grimy stuff that we got to do sometimes. You know? Oh, actually build these watches? Yeah, we together. assemble watches yeah. in our, oh. we have 3,000 uh, square foot um, warehouse and office space in Portsmouth, Virginia, where we actually assemble the watches and ship them out from. You know, and I have the Atlanta office down here uh, for our, most of our marketing and and things of that nature, sales. Yeah, man, so how did all this come about, though? So my business partner started it, you know, always been fly, always, you know, dressed well, and was looking for a watch. Couldn't find one, right? Not not one that spoke to him, not one was good design at a price point that he can afford, and, you know, wasn't imitating all the other watch, watch companies out there. Right. And then also, he didn't see himself in anything. He didn't see himself in any marketing. He didn't see himself in any advertising. He didn't see himself, uh, uh, the companies didn't speak to us at all. Right. So he found that it was an opportunity to actually create a watch company. Started with a Kickstarter campaign, you know, $20,000, raised that, and we've been all bootstrapped from there. That's what's up, man. What you bring for us today? Yeah, so that's that's our uh, one of our newest drops, um, which is the White Panda. And what I say about drops, I want people to think of Nike, right? Mm. You know, you come down with size like, you know, hey, you know, stuff is sold out. Or it's intentionally sold out, right? right? Because when we drop things, we drop in fire every time that we drop something, right? Top quality. Top stuff. quality. That's our Tuskegee Airmen watch. It's a collaboration with Tuskegee Airmen. Official license, actually, uh, uh, percentage of proceeds go back to the Tuskegee Airmen. Now, see, that's dope as hell right there. Man. That's dope as hell. When you can do stuff like that, best, that's dope. Best, best selling watch really? by far. Best seller watch. Yep, that and that Juneteenth. Um, we can't keep them in. Th like this is a That's a replica of the Juneteenth watch. Absolutely. That's hard. Yeah. Y'all see that? <laughs> Damn. So man, what's been the biggest like biggest like influence for your business? Like where has most of your traffic come from? Where have most of your customers and requests and all of that stuff? Yeah, so I will definitely like the credit. Randy Williams, I don't know if we actually call that out. I always like to call out my co-owner. Um, Randy Williams, he's a branding genius. Really? He's a branding genius, right? He understands how to talk to our customers. You know, we have a lot of credibility in our community. Um, quality product, great customer service, just some of the foundations just to get your your get you there right. and then it's elements of the brand right you look at our watch and it's like oh that's a dope watch it's like oh tally and twine what does tally and twine mean tally and twine it's a cross street in a once the dilapidated neighborhood in portsmouth virginia mm. uh the the neighborhood reinvested in itself and turned itself around that's you know awesome. you, it's a testament that you don't have to finish where you started right so tally and twine is that guiding light that we like to be for us in our uh, community yeah. number seven Number seven is the only number on the watch. All of our watches, you see, you see that? It's the only number on the watch, right? It's a number of completion. It reminds you to finish what you start, right? Man, so once you start on. peeling back the layers of the brand, there's always a, a Easter egg getting there for you. Absolutely. Just like that Tuskegee watch. That is the actual plane uh, that the Tuskegee Airmen flew. Right? Those details, uh, matter that's what's up so like what was your involvement how when when the idea was brought to you were like were you instantly on board or did oh yeah some convincing? so randy was my college roommate so we've always been entrepreneurs 
kicking so, ideas. Back kicking before. ideas. All we had different companies together. I had several companies before. Um, he found his product market fit in his house, right? He started our first samples. You know, okay. You know, then he started getting some traction. I was like, oh, okay, you really got something here. And it came to the point that where it was, bro, you you a business guy. You've been in Fortune 100 for the last 10 years. I need some help. I don't know what I need help with. I don't know what it is, but come help me. It's something. There. It's something, right? And I came and I, I really put structure around the business and put structure around our relationships and poured into my network and, you know, started building the business. We've been growing at 150% year over year. That's what's uh, up. And what year is this? And this is year 10. Okay. Year 10, yep. All right. All right. So, what's the dream collaboration with you? Like, is it y'all want to work with? I mean, LeBron James, man. Like, LeBron yeah. James, that's what's up. You <laughs> <laughs> make him a championship <laughs> watch. <laughs> that's right. We have relationships with Steph Curry, too, uh, and his uh, investment uh, company. Um, but really, we invest in our community. Yeah. However, that looks like, you know, we are very. Uh, particular in who we do business with, how we do business with them, um, because our brand really matters. Um, and people are people, right? You know, things happen. So we don't try to get like too in there uh, with a particular company or brand, but if those opportunities present themselves, we'll definitely, you know, look at those. We've done some cool collaborations so far with Orlando Magic. You know, we have Orlando Magic Watch. Um, we have a Tuskegee Airmen watch. We have some colleges and universities that's dropping. Um, we also have some organizations that's dropping too. I don't want to get too, you know, into the details on who those are, but you know, they're relevant to the community. Bro, what can, what can we do one? We can. Let's do us a that's collab. Why, that's why I'm here. Instead of the <laughs> seven being the only one on there, okay. we can put the eight and the five on there. That'd be, that'd be dope. That'd That's hard. That'd be dope. Came from you. You heard it. Man, see, we put that together. You heard it. So, like, what do you, what is he like, what do you want to do for the future? Like, how does this look taking the brand forward? Yeah, so we're in the midst of scaling right now. You know, yeah. I always like to, you know, we need to be, we need to, our companies need to be multi-million dollar companies, right? Absolutely. You know, uh, and we're scaling in in certain ways. One is just meeting the demand that's already there. Now that's see. All right, we have so now much. Now you in the door. Now you right. they didn't bought all, right. all the products. That's right. It's there. So keeping up with the demand is yeah. one thing. Uh, two, we have been doing more uh, corporate sales. You know, which has been customizations and, and those type things. That's been a, a big revenue driver for us. Yeah. Um, and then, like you say, partnerships, collaborations. Uh, things like this will uh, give us more cultural credibility. That's what I was just about to ask you, man. For somebody who's watching this right now, some, my, somebody who might just like watches, mm -hmm. like, you know, old school black dude might just like watches. Why does he need to add this brand to the collection? Because of the brand, mm. right? Because of what we stand for. Right. You know, how many black owned watch companies you know? Uh, how many black owned watch companies you know have a, a, a Juneteenth watch? You know, Tuskegee Airmen watch, right? We are made for us, Yeah. right? When you wear our watch, I guarantee you get more compliments than you get from anybody, anybody any other watch you have on, mm. right? See? It's that, because you're wearing it with pride. It ain't totally the watch. The watch is super dope, but it's, it's what you exude when you wear the watch. It means something to you, you know? It matters to you. You have a story behind Black it. Black watches matter. Black watches matter. <laughs> You want? You need to be a PR. Are you gonna be a PR marketing person? Bro, I'm just. Fi I'm figuring it out. Eyes, I'm yeah. still at a point in my life where I'm trying to figure out what I'm good at. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know what you're good at. But I mean, I ain't the best yet. Uh, I'm working on being yeah. the best at some shit. Yeah, yeah. And it might be what you just said. Let's go. I might need to be out here pitching products. You don't have nothing on. We're gonna get you. We're gonna fix that. I did it on purpose. Oh, see. I did it on see? purpose. Cause see, look, okay. I learned in business. If you look like you need it, you'll never get it. <laughs> so I would have came in here with a big ass watch. You wouldn't be like, Los, we get you a watch. <laughs> or you gonna be like, oh, you already got a watch. So you mm -hmm. gonna move on to somebody who ain't got one. So you need a watch. Most definitely. That's too and easy. then it would look crazy if me pitching my watch collab and right. if I got on a watch already. You are good at something. See? Yep. 
<laughs> One smart black boy. <laughs> and now, what can they? What can they purchase? What can they? What's the website? What's All the online, social media? Tally and Twine, Tally and Twine everywhere. Tally and Twine .com, Tally and Twine on. Um, uh, all the social platforms as T A L L E Y A N D T. Yeah. Y'all got watches for ladies too? Yes, we have women's line. This is a women's watch right here. Uh, we have our 46 millimeters of men, 41 millimeters of women. Yeah. We have special bands for them. We have also special watches designed particularly for women. Can you go to the site and like design you something? Or? No, no. You got to get what we. we you got to get in touch with somebody. Yeah, yeah well. You know, we enjoy it, man. You, gotta, yeah. you, know, you just don't customize enjoy it. That's aftermarket. No, no, no. Yeah, no. Well, we uh, we have a model that we try to keep simple and lean. Yeah. Right? If we want to get into the business operations of it, you know, being lean and being profitable is the most important thing. Yeah, man. To all the people who don't know, tell them how important having a nice watch is. It's, it's, a, it's a status symbol, right? But the flex is not how much that watch costs, yeah. the flex is what that watch mean to you, right? How that watch make you feel. You know, can you identify with the company? Can you identify with Rolex? Can you really? Can you really I, I identify can't. with AP? I can't. You can't. Like, can't. yeah, it's a status symbol. Them, you don't know them. I ain't seen them out doing nothing. I don't know who, who the face of the brand or nothing. I heard it wasn't even a watch company. But you know, you it's a nonprofit organization. But that's a whole nother show. Yeah, yeah. They got it's a conglomerate or some stuff. They, yeah, they, the they way that they the way that they put the business on paper so yeah. they can be profitable is correct. Correct. It's not your typical LLC. That's right. But that's why we're here. We're here to close that gap. Right. Right. We're here to make stuff for our community and for for everyone. But no shame about for our community. Yeah. You know, unapologetic about it. Well, look, bro, I'm sitting here looking, and I know that y'all see them on the table and all these, but these are nice quality watches, nice leather bands, mm -hmm. and, it's, and this is real. It got weight to it, too. Mm -hmm. So make sure you hit them up and support, man. Italian twine watch brand. I like that, bro. That, I see why y'all can't keep this one. Yeah, bro. yeah. Tuskegee, and the concept is so dope, and then y'all giving back, too. It means something. Yeah, man. So look here, we appreciate you stopping through here, letting us check out some products. I might have to keep these. I don't know, bro. You gotta leave. You send me one of these. And you want, I, I know it's promo, but I, I like them. You like them? Man, send me one of them. Bro. Okay, okay. We'll get you one made. And then you gotta get back in touch with me about doing the collab with the 85 South. Oh yeah, we all over that. We're talking to the team already, you know, so we we are down that path. That's hard. I'm wanna watch with the flip. I want my shit to flip, flip. open. <laughs> I can get my shit to flip over. Uh, maybe. I want to flip over. want to flip? Shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look, man, I appreciate you stopping Thank through you here. Thank you so much. I Let me appreciate, check out the watches. Greatly man. appreciate so make the sure opportunity. Y'all support Italian Twine, and we out of here. 85 South Show, Black Market. You hit the bell, don't you? I hit the bell. That man is money on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get a flick.